What is going on everyone, this is Nier again, and hey for you, some free for all gunplay, the, actually the 18 guns gun game on the map lockdown. But we're going to be talking about gameplay today, it's a rather short video, but it's just a nice little backdrop to visualize some stuff while I talk to you, because I came up with an awesome ass topic last night, so I'm just kind of laying there last night, having no idea what to make today's video about, and that just kind of hit me. And I think this is pretty interesting, especially since I have subscribers from all around the world, so a bunch of different opinions will be coming into play, I think you guys are going to be like this, so let's, let's just get into this. The idea that came to me was one respawn. Let's picture an alter alternate universe for a moment, if you will, or even you know just an alternate reality where everyone in the world got one extra life. They got one respawn. Uh, for example, if you were to die, um, let's say right now as I'm making this video, if I were to randomly, someone were to shoot a gun and it were to randomly go through my window and shoot me in the head, I would respawn right back to where I was. But you only get one respawn. That's the whole point, it's one respawn. What would you do with that one respawn. Now there's a couple of different options you could do. First and foremost, first thing that came to me is I started thinking about the crazy people out there who just go like bombing people and then just respawn. But picture it this way. Let's say you were to go into a building with a bomb and blow up everybody and <laughs> guess what? You're gonna respawn and so is everyone else. And then you're gonna get caught and you're gonna go to jail. So, you know, you probably, won't, you probably don't wanna do any crimes with this one respawn because you will respawn and they will take you to jail and you will probably get butt raped and die in prison. So don't think about anything you know, jail related. Um, there's a couple of different options you could do. I'd say, for example, with this one respawn, would, how many of you would just kind of wussy out and not do and just not do anything scary throughout your entire life? And uh, basically, you save that one respawn just in case something bad would happen. It'd be, it'd be an unforeseen circumstances like a, like a car accident or uh, you know anything like that, a house catching on fire or something. You know, just random things like that that could possibly kill you. Would you save it for that so you could respawn and live from it? Or would you do something crazy that like you would otherwise be too scared to do knowing you know, of fear of death? Uh, for me, okay, I'm going to let you guys into my life a little bit. I'm scared to death of flying. I hate flying. I... <laughs> I've flown once in my life. I've flown once in my life. Um, I live in Pennsylvania, and I forget how old I was. I think it was like 15, maybe 16. Uh, we flew down to Florida for my grandmother's not great grandmother's 90th birthday, and I was scared. I mean, it's only a two-hour flight. I hated every second of it. I like they almost had to drug me just to you know calm me down because I was like puking my guts out, and it, it was horrible. I I couldn't take it. I hate flying. Flying scares hell out of me. The reason flying scares hell out of me is you know if something goes wrong with that plane, I'm just not 100% confident that we're gonna be able to land it safely and we're gonna live. And one thing I've always wanted to do in life is to go to England, you know, go over the other, that side of the world. I've always wanted to go there, but there is no way in hell you will ever catch me on a 14 hour flight over the ocean. There is no emergency landing in the ocean. No, I would never ever do, if I were to ever like go to the other side of the world, I'd like go up to the Bering Strait and fly over that, it's only like 20 minutes, and then drive through Russia all the way to England. Like, I'm scared, I'm that scared of flying, but if I had one respawn, I would just go right ahead and I would fly, I would get on the plane and I'd fly over to England just fine because if something were to happen and we were to crash in the ocean and die, you know, I would, you know, respawn back in America, I'd be fine. And if for every reason we were to make it, you know, all the way to England just fine, I'd be I'd be perfectly happy flying back because if we crash on the way back, I could just respawn back in England. So that's one thing I would do. You know, what would you guys do? I want to you guys answer me in the comments. What would you do with your one respawn? You know, would you save it? Uh, just in case any unforeseen circumstances would happen, or would you do something crazy like jump off the Empire State Building and make a video about it and become you know, a YouTube millionaire? Or would you would you go ahead and you know skydive, or would you go shark you know fight a shark or, or ride a rhinoceros, or what would you do? What would you guys do? That's the whole point. What would you do with your one respawn? Let me know in the comment section below. Hope you guys all enjoyed the gameplay. Kind of a short video, but I still think it's gonna be a winner nonetheless. So hope you guys all enjoyed and have a wonderful day, guys. All right, well, I hope you guys will enjoy that video. I'm just definitely interested to see what everyone's going to say about, like, what all your opinions are like, because there's so many different people in the world, so many different kinds of people in the world, and everyone's opinion is probably going to be different as to what they would do with their one response. So I'm definitely crazy interested to see what you guys are all going to say, and be sure to share the video with your friends. Share it with your friends, tweet it out, uh, show other people, just everything like that, just so people can actually, more people can come here, more people can put in the comments, you know, what they would do with their one response. Just, I think it'd be crazy fun for me, as well as you guys, to go through and read what everyone would do. So, uh, but now it's time for the poster here on my channel. So on the left hand side of your screens, I'm all for three report cards. The 66 kill game of domination with the MP7, running around capped flags, getting kills, having fun. And also reviewing Mall for three now that we're about halfway through uh, the life cycle of it and kind of like giving opinions on how I'd rate it. On the right hand side of your screens, the latest episode of Mob Friday, a search and destroy it mob. Both pretty good videos. If you're new around here, like my gameplay, commentary, things like that, click subscribe, so join your screen. There's a link in the description where you can follow me on Twitter. And on the bottom right hand side of your screen, guys, is a mystery box. Holy crap, I talk fast. And anything can be in the mystery box, so click for you guys if you like clicking, and it'll open a new tab for you. Uh, so you can click multiple things at once. Uh, remember to write the video. I hope you guys all have a wonderful day.